hey let's spice it up a little bit tonight we're gonna make a steak Diablo Chesapeake style and a rice pilaf here's all we're gonna need well for our rice pilaf we have our rice some beef cubes some sauteed or we're gonna saute some onions green peppers and mushrooms and garlic then for our Diablo well for the steak I used a New York strip boneless and I've been marinating that in Worcestershire sauce for a couple hours in the refrigerator and a little bit of cracked peppercorn on there but for our Diablo sauce we need a little bit of jalapeno pepper and I mean just a little some tomato and I'm gonna use some dehydrated green peppers onions and mushrooms that I just made with my Excalibur uh, food dryer then we have some Dijon mustard, Worcestershire sauce, a little more pepper, not much, and the Chesapeake part comes in with the Old Bay, and our olive oil. Now we're not going to make a lot of Diablo sauce. We don't want to take away from the flavor of the steak. We just want to have a little enhancement to it. Well, I'm going to get the rice started first, and then we'll work on the steak. So now my vegetables are nice and sauteed. I'm going to add my rice. We'll stir that together into the oil. Put our water in, together and let that simmer. All right, the rice is almost done. So now I'm going to get ready to do the steak. And you see, I didn't use a lot of pepper. I, I don't like things real hot, but anyway, what I'm going to do is brown our garlic. Now on the tomato, you see I cut some of the seeds out. Just make some nice little cuts here while that's heating up. That's ready. The garlic smells good. It's got a nice brown to it. You see our garlic is nice and brown. I'm going to put my steak in. I'm going to add my dehydrated vegetables. My jalapeno. My tomato. Just a little bit of Dijon. more Worcestershire. I don't think I'm going to add the black pepper. I think we're good on that. And now, our Old Bay. Again, just a little bit. Kind of mix this up. Now that, that, that looks pretty good. I don't think we really need to add anything to that. You could add a little wine to it if you wanted to, or a little bit of just water. But see, that's really all... Okay, you know what? We can add a little brandy to it. Okay, let's do that. There. Look at that. Let's see that. I'll play that for us a little bit. Yeah, there we go. All right. Yeah, that was a good idea. I like it. See, the Diablo sauce is more just kind of like a topping here. And that steak is done for me. Now, you could also have just put the steak on the grill. But that's ready. Let me see. I put my steak here in the middle. I'm going to put a little bit of the vegetable on top, the Diablo sauce. Most of it on the side. That is ready. A little bit of our rice pilaf. On this side. I could use a little bigger plate, I guess. But 
There. Now we have a beautiful, scrumptious dinner, nutritional, and I really like, look at this, this is, this is nice, the dehydrated uh, vegetables, because it's so hard to keep onions, green peppers, mushrooms, it's hard to keep those on a boat for any length of time. By dehydrating them, I can keep them for, I'll bet you I can keep these things for about a month, maybe longer. Anyway, bon appetit!